Hello everybody, thank you for joining me, this is Game God Fluent, bringing you episode 18 of Let's Play 7th Star of Wolf's Moon Studios 2022 RPG. Alright, um, we are here searching with, um, Duncan who is gaining XP, so he is not at the level cap, apparently. Um, wow, he has some cool stuff. Primal Strength raises attack by 20, increases mana by 50 and magic by 10, raises life by 100, dex by 20, defense by 10. Oh my gosh. Wow. Innate Crit. So, yeah, we're going to go find the elves today, hopefully. So let's go ahead and uh, get into it. Maybe we should um, go ahead and innate magic. And innate dexterity, I think. Okay. Alright. We're here. Let's head in. Welcome to Lockwood Village. Thank you for having us. I'm King... Wait a minute. Thank you for having us. I am King Duncan. We know who you are, King Duncan. Great ruler of Alberta. Defender of the Worm Skull, Savior of the Demon Realm. Hmm? What? Much of our history is intertwined, Lord Duncan. And you must be Quarry from Reinhardt Kingdom. That I am. If it is the aid of the Elven people that you seek, you do not need to seek any more. You shall have it. I am Alessia. You brought the Dark Elves to your side already. The last piece to unite the continent is us. I will personally join you in your battle on the front lines. The Elves stand with you, Duncan and Quarry. Lysia joined. Well, then it's settled. That was painless. I assume we will rally back to Reinhardt Kingdom to honor your new allies? Most likely. Very good. I must return to Alberta for now, but I will join you in Reinhardt soon enough. Thank you, Lord Duncan. See you soon. Oh, we didn't get to use him very much. Quarry, what have you managed to pull off? This kingdom owes you a deep debt of sincere gratitude. King Duncan of Alberta will also be joining us soon enough. Lord Warwick will also join when we call upon him. Outstanding. We're going to have a small party this evening to celebrate you and our new guests. I will see all of you again very soon. Come in. Quarry, I didn't get the chance to properly thank you. For what? Your bravery. Everything you have done. We didn't get the chance to really talk on the road back here. I lead the elves. It's my job to keep them safe. From what I can tell, you're trying to keep all of us safe. It took some real leadership and strength to unite all of the South the way you have. I see. I just wanted to personally thank you. I'll see you this evening. See you soon. I guess I didn't think anything of it. Like I was just doing what I was supposed to be doing. Okay, so it looks like we're going to... Be playing a little party here. Quarry, you look incredible. Thank you, Asir. I don't know how I feel about this. Embrace it. It's what you deserve. Where's that music coming from? There are a bunch of clowns downstairs performing. Oh, I see. Where's King Reinford? He's in the ballroom downstairs with the clowns. You're not joining them. I just wanted to get a look at you first, but Alessia beat me to it. Girl privileges, I guess. I would ask if a swordsman like you knows how to relax when the battle is on pause, 
but I guess I could also direct the question at myself. Really, all I can think about right now is what is coming. And who the hell is King Duncan, really? What is his mysterious past? I don't know, Quarry. We'll figure it out, though. Maybe Madawin will be around tonight. I really don't think this is her type of thing, but we'll see. Try to enjoy yourself. Okay, I don't want to go downstairs just yet. Well, I guess that's pretty much where we have to go, but... We'll explore around first. I have a little opera scene out here on the balcony. <laughs> so I hope you guys are doing well. Um... I don't know how much of this game is left, but we're going to try to wrap it up as best we can. Let's see. Downstairs in the ballroom. Oh. Mark Rook. Hey, Corey. I just love the structure of a castle. So beautiful. Corey, this party is in your honor. Please go enjoy yourself. Um... Okay. I think the prison's down this way. I don't remember where the ballroom is. But I'm just checking all around. I guess this is the way to go. Clowns. Oh, that's the ballroom. No one is allowed in the treasure room right now. Please, we have to concentrate while we play these songs. The food is delicious. We regularly have parties over at Black Rock. Midnight always felt it was great for the people to celebrate what we have. I can see that. Yeah, it makes sense. I'm guessing you're really not the partying type. Neither was Midnight. You seem to share a lot of traits with other powerful leaders. I guess you're all wired a certain way. I guess. Nice seeing you. Corey, you look lovely. So nice to get to speak with everyone. Thank you, King Reinford. I'm sure you are worried about what is to come, but steady yourself. Leave the worrying for another day. I will try. By the way, did you see Madawin yet? No, I have not. She may have arrived late and just didn't come down. She always ransacks the library on the first floor. Maybe check there for her. Okay. The library. Um, that's not a library. On the first floor, um, up here maybe? Please go attend your party. Where was the library? Huh. Oh. <coughs> King Reinford said you would be here. I didn't think you would even show up. How are you enjoying the unification party? You look lovely, by the way. I guess it's good for the king to get to know everyone. Also good for them to get to know each other. It certainly doesn't hurt. You did a good job bringing everyone around the way you did. What did you think of King Duncan? There's something else to him. More than meets the eye if you get what I mean. Hmm, try to explain? 
The elves all knew him. They said some weird stuff about unifying the demon realm. Interesting. What was his reaction? He looked confused. Why would that be? I've always been pretty forward with you, Quarry, but there are some things now I have to keep from you for your own protection. I don't understand your meaning. I'll make sure that you do soon enough, but for now, for everyone's safety, it's better this way. Alright, I guess I'll be patient then. Did you speak with Garion yet? He was on the roof waiting for you. No, I'll go and have a word. On the roof. So, that one's pretty easy to find. That'll be down this way. I think. Oh, no, wait. Probably that balcony area, right? Which was... This way. Good evening, Garion. Good evening, young warrior. Although you could pass as a queen right now. You're too kind. I'm serious. Is this something you've ever thought about? I don't think that's in the hand of cards I've been dealt. You think war and battle is all you'll ever be? That is enough for you? It was enough for you. Why would you want to be anything like me, Quarry? I don't know how to be anything else. Where is all this coming from? What are you even saying right now, Garion? I've watched you grow up, and after this war is over, and it will end one day, I want you to have a normal life. Is something wrong? You've never spoke like this before. What was that? We're being attacked now? Those pieces of scum. Let's go. We have to protect the king. Hmm. Okay, Garion. Um, he can learn some skills. Counterattack, crit... 500 for an 8 hit. Um. An 8 crit encounter. Let's go ahead and an 8 crit. More Lord's Wrath. Raises crit by 1. Um. That's good. Okay. Oh boy, alright, um... Soldier of Darkness... Let's go ahead and boil their blood. Nice. Level up for Quarry. Bunch of ones. Some veteran XP, a thousand credits. What in the world is going on? These aren't from the north. They're otherworldly. Okay. Let's go ahead and save while we're at it. Oh my. Look at this thing. Looking pretty cool, but probably pretty easy to kill. A hell hunger. Oh yeah, nice crit. Garion knows how to crit too. Chomp. Mm. Let's go ahead and touch of light him. Attack and uh We have to get to Reinford. This isn't good. He's badly wounded. A seer, oh no. Can't lose a seer.
<laughs> Go ahead and want to smoke, guys. Nice XP. Thousand. Um. Oh no, not Mark Rook. Hmm. No comment on Mark Rook. Corey, Gorion, what the hell is going on? Who are you? Wait, I recognize you. You're from the north. How did you get in here? Did you do all of this? There's no time to explain. Help me save your king. Huh. Okay, pretty cool looking thing here. Um, Underbelly Demon. Go ahead and quadra it. Oh, Trine. Okay. Fist of War. Crashes upon your foes. Attack. Onslaught. Athos unleashes his wrath upon one target. Strike. And the usual. Um. Dang. 40 mana for Onslaught. Okay. Let's do it. Trine. Boom. Oh my. Okay. Um not offering much resistance. Uh oh, let's go triple attack. Um Leech Life and Fist of War. Plague poisoned us. Um, let's go ahead and heavenly armor. Uh, dark sword and quadra should end this. Maybe not. though um wrath leech life and how about triple attack there we go underbelly demon defeated that was cool Trine is level 30 as well. Many months ago. Huh. While things came together in the south for Quarry and her allies, those in the north were also preparing themselves for impending war. A hero of the north, Trine, was busy working for his kingdom of Zigorn under strict rules to prepare the armies. Oh, that north. We've never been up there. Wow. Trine is tasked to find the magical relic that can put an end to the war and give the north victory. But what would he uncover through his search? Dang, there's still, still some content left. Oh my. Okay. Pretty wicked cool. Quite a bit of stuff. Dang, son. Okay. Good to see you, Trine. God King Anubis. You have much to do. I notified Sky and Alden to meet you at the front of the palace. They'll be assisting you. I'll be needing the help that much, huh? Better safe than sorry. We don't want any inter interruptions while you are on this journey. What will you have of me first? You'll travel east to Rose's castle and check on her. 
Her attack on Fort Rembrandt was not a successful one. Anything she needs and assist her. Correct. All right, I can do that. The tomes we found speak of a seventh star. We believe it is a weapon that we can use to defeat the South. Once you return, I should have a location of what it could be. All right, no problem. I'll get it taken care of. I'm heading east now. Tread cautiously as you seek out help. Huh, so we're playing as Shrine. Level 17. Um... We can synthesis still. Apparently. Don't think I should make him a monster male because... Oh, we still have all this stuff. We shouldn't have this. It's a little sloppy design because now we can really deck out trying when we shouldn't be able to. So I'm just going to go ahead and not equip him because he shouldn't have access to that gear. All praise the great Anubis. Huh. So we're in for quite a bit more game, guys. Which I am down for. Let's go. I did not expect this. Ornate Elixir. I did not expect this. We'll return to that. This is cool stuff, man. Wicked cool. Bow tie. Okay, so we can equip the bow tie at least. Yeah, 25 MP and HP, 5 defense, 5 magic defense. We'll try to play it, you know, realistically, not just deck him out with monster mail and stuff. Excuse me. Um, whoops. <coughs> I assume this way is the same. Symmetrical to the other path? No, it's a little bit different. Okay. Wait a minute. Head downstairs first. Zugorn Temple B1. Huh. We'll crack the code here. Okay, we've got a chest. See what's in here. Ziggorn Pendant. The pride and joy of Ziggorn increases XP vet XP gain by 25%. Also, MP by 20, HP by 5, defense and magic defense by 4, hit rate and evade plus 5, and XP plus 25. Cool. Nice find for sure. Um... Well, that's weird. It kind of skips that area. Nice chest. Wall of Zigorn. What is the Wall of Zigorn? So we shouldn't have all this stuff. Wall of Zigorn. Mm, it's not an item. It's not a weapon, must be an armor of some sort. It is 
has a shield, increases resistance to fire, ice, and thunder. 10 attack, MP, and HP, loses 2 magic defense. That's okay. Nice item. And so we will go ahead and not use that gear that, you know... Oh, two chests over there. Dang, son. Chests be everywhere. I like Zigorn Temple. How do we get out to get, to get those two chests, I wonder? Philosopher's Stone. This incredibly rare stone increases life and mana regen by 1 and 10 HP and MP. Nice. Can we come out here somehow? Hmm. We can go down further. Okay, that takes us back here. I think we come out here and then go to the left. Yeah. Tent. Elixir of Magic. So... We shouldn't be using this. We shouldn't have access to our inventory from before. But, uh, you know, it is what it is, I guess. It's everything in Zigorn, I believe. I guess I didn't go this way. <laughs> 20 times greater mana potions. We also shouldn't be able to synthesize with the stuff we have. So I'll see how it works without putting him in great gear, you know. Good to see you again, Trine. Likewise. I hear we're headed east to check on Rosa. Sounds that way. Any idea what she needs? No clue. We'll see when we arrive. Afterwards, it sounds like we are relic hunting. Ooh, exciting. Right up my alley. Sky joined and Alden joined. Level 12. Okay, Necklace of Celerity, life plus 20. Dex plus 20, significant magical enhancement. A sleek belt with a magical enhancement that raises hit, crit, and evasion. Dragon garb, crystal cap, status shield. Dragon staff, dragon shield, dragon cap, crystal coat, ring of brilliance, mana plus 50. Magic's plus 20. Same with the necklace. Um, Trine is a noble warrior that serves the north. I can see his stuff. 25% evasion. A mercenary for hire. Sky is incredibly lethal, but also a quick decision maker. 53 dex is her strong point. She has the status shield. Evasion is also 25%. Critical hit is 10%. And counterattack is 5%. And Alden is a druid. 57 magic. A soft and pure heart. Alden finds himself in a difficult position fighting for the north. He can get hit with all that stuff. 14% evasion. Alright, um... Let's go. Okay, we're going east, so there's something even north. Where do you think this one is going to end up leading us? War. Anubis and the others won't budge, huh? Seems like there's no way out. The southern kingdoms may all feel the same way, though. Guess we'll be figuring that out next, huh? Maybe after we get all this settled. I'm sure after Rose's failed attempt, it's only going to embolden her and Shobi. Right, the disrespect of defeat won't sit well with them. Ah, so Shobi and them, I remember from the beginning of the game. Ring of Brilliance. <clears throat> we can go ahead and put that on her. Oh, let's check their skills, actually. Trine has no magic. Our ninja has double attack, triple attack, quadra, shadow walker. Increase evasion and dexterity as a swift action. Decisive strike, a bonus strike against your opponent, and shurikens. Strike all enemies with a barrage of shurikens. Alton has jewels of nature. Heal the wounds of all allies. Purge, remove poisons and most status effects. Windstorm, powerful gusts of wind hits all enemies. 
Cataclysm, release powerful earth magic to hit all enemies, and earth and hail. Same idea, so she can, or he can use the, also the ring of brilliance. <clears throat> Another 50 mana and 20 magic attack. Ring of might, um, oh, he's a warlord, by the way, okay. Ring of might, I guess we'll go ahead and give the sky. Twenty attack, twenty-five HP, one percent crit rate. Nice. Well, this is gonna be cool, man. We still do have quite a bit of game left. Then there is twenty plus hours. Ring of Fortitude. Um. It would give twenty-five HP. 5 defense, 5 magic defense. We'll pass on that. I don't want to lose the 25 MP. Alright, let's see how this goes. Fighting some chickens. Fist of War crashes upon our enemies. Um, sure, rock hoppers. Uh, go ahead and do a decisive strikes. Check that out. Um, go ahead and increase evasion and dexterity. And throw shurikens. You go ahead and do a cataclysm. Dang. Okay, zero. They can't mess with Trine. <clears throat> they can mess with our ninja, though. Good thing they're all attacking Trine, at least. Oh my! Okay. Okay, um... <clears throat> let's go ahead and Quadra attack, and let's go ahead and... Um... Earth and Hail. Nice counter. Dang. Boom. Alright, level ups. <clears throat> Try and gets two mana and some ones. Alden gets two magic and some ones. 1200 crystals. Um, guess we have to use a phoenix down. And jewels of nature. Maybe we do have to deck them out in what we have. I don't know. Dragon katana. Boom. 25 HP and MP, 5 attack, 4 hit rate, and 2 critical. Beautiful. Okay. Um. Quadra on the Cyclops. Um. Shadow Walker. <coughs> Want to level that up. Uh, decisive strike. Boom, nice crit. Quadra and... Windstorm. Ooh, nice crit again. <clears throat> 64 and paralysis. Um, let's triple. Let's go ahead and purge the paralysis. First time using a lance with anybody. Kick. Paralyze Alden. That's not good. Um, let's go ahead and remedy her. 
you go ahead and triple attack. Nice crit. Um, <clears throat> strike. Double attack. Uh, decisive strike. Double attack, and you go ahead and jewels of nature. All right. It's platinum, silver, and iron, and a tent was found. of might attack plus 20 life plus 25 uh, we use the necklace of celerity um, how about fist of war And uh, let's see here. Quadra attack. And you go ahead and earth inhale. Nice crit. Counter. Quadra, Shurikens, and Jewels of Nature. <clears throat> cool. Alright. Should get some nice XP, level up for Sky. Two dexterity and some ones. 750 crystals. Eight times remedies. So. Oh. It's Dune Walkers. Let's go ahead and Fist of War them. Yeah, this is definitely assuming we don't have an in inventory full of stuff we can use giving us like eight remedies 20 greater potions quadra attack and earth and hail dang they're pretty tough too Shurikens. Hmm. Cataclysm. Alden. He gained some ones, two mana. Elixir <clears throat> hmm. of Strength. Cyclops. Uh, strike. Quadra Attack. Shadow Walker. Decisive strike. 
you go ahead and quadra attack and you uh cataclysm I guess Did not paralyze. Triple. Oh, she's out of mana. Do a double attack. You go ahead and throw her a um, greater mana pot, I guess. <coughs> As we whittle down this Cyclops, we need a Jewels of Nature attack. Nice. Double attack. Triple attack. Jewels of Nature. There's a crit. Um, strike. Fist of War. Decisive Strike. Shurikens and Earth and Hail. Alright, another Cyclops down. <coughs> Taking some of our resources to do so. Platinum Iron and Mithril. Scroll of Learning. <clears throat> Gain 100 veteran experience. Hmm. Let's, um... Use some minor mana potions, I guess. And save. Okay, we about are ready to wrap this episode up. Um, let's see. <clears throat> Definitely want to use the strikes here with this group. Um, attack and earth and hail there's a crit let's do a triple attack triple attack and earth and hail again Earth and Hail should end this. Oh, maybe not. Alrighty. Couple level ups. Ooh, Trine gains two attacks, 17 life, one vitality, two dexterity for Sky, two mana, five uh, life. Alden is hurt. We'll go ahead and leave on this cliffhanger of these three chests, see what's in them next time. I want to thank you guys for joining me. Still looks like there's plenty of game left, so feel free to stick around uh, for future episodes and tune in. Uh, we'd love to have you guys. Let's go. Let's continue playing. Um, apparently there's plenty of hours left. Um, but yeah, thanks so much for watching. I do hope you're enjoying the LP and enjoyed this episode. I will see you guys next time. Much love, peace, and joy. We open these chests next time and continue. See you guys then. Bye-bye.